The Cleveland Browns have been a terrible football team, a terrible franchise for the past decade and then some years. But this year, did something change with this year's draft? Or does HBO actually have it right once again, like the Browns have had it right for the last 10 years? The HBO is actually doing a show on the Cleveland Browns, and it's called Hard Knocks. And uh, it's usually for teams that are terrible, terrible franchises. And the Browns haven't had this show on them for 10 plus years which is a decade, back in the 1990s, so now it's time for them to have it on them again. But I think maybe they're mistaken in doing this because I think the Browns could actually have a shot at winning a few games this year. I'll tell you all the details. So obviously, Hugh Jackson is 1-31 with the Cleveland Browns, but yet somehow he's still on the team. Baffles me too. Not really sure how that works. Usually when you don't win a football game in one season, let alone one game a season, you get fired. It doesn't matter what team you're on. The Steelers would have fired someone if they go 6-10 properly. Let's be honest here. But, I think the Browns have a shot here with their new QB, Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield, a lot of people are, are telling me that Johnny Manziel is the same way, but Baker Mayfield is just another Johnny Manziel. I wouldn't just say that just yet. I think Baker Mayfield has a shot. Um, I actually, I'm a Steelers fan, obviously, but I, I think it would be cool if the Browns actually won more than like four games this upcoming season, but actually even four even one game would be 100% improvement from last year, let's be honest here. But Baker Mayfield, I think that's their first key to actually winning a few football games this upcoming season in 2018. The Browns' second key to winning in 2018, more than like zero games, is uh, their, their wide receivers. They have a bunch of new receivers, not to mention Jarvis Landry. He was a, re a few years ago, he was with the Dolphins, and now he is with uh, the Browns. So that's a huge improvement. Um, Corey Clemen, he was overwhelmed the first two seasons with the Cle Cleveland Browns, and he's only won one game with them back of last season with the Chargers. I think that game went to overtime. I still remember remember that game. I was happy for the Browns, I'm going to be honest. Um, and then they also have Antonio Callaway. So those are the three huge Wide receivers for the Cleveland Browns that really help improve their team this season. Then there's the general manager, John Dorsey. He has to do a good job this season or he's not going to be here. If he doesn't win at least four games to four to, I'm going to say four to eight games this season, probably more closer to eight. But if he doesn't win a few games this season, he's not going to stay. He has to do it the right way. And um, if he's not successful, the organization is not successful. So that's the third key to the Browns winning in 2018. If you guys enjoyed this video, then consider subscribing, and I'll see you all next video.